that's what you're that's what you try to do in overtime if you can hold them to a, to a field goal. And that's why it's so important to win the toss. You know, uh, Highland's a heck of a football team. You know, we just uh, feel really fortunate to be able to come back and, and make the plays there at the end. That's, that's a big catch and big throw right there at the end when we needed it. Talk about that third down throw. Uh, what, what was the play call and kind of take us through it? Well, it was just. What was it, third and 12 or third and 14? You know, you got to get a first down. You know, you never want to leave it up to your kicker. We got a pretty good kicker, but you don't want to leave it up to him just to go to another OT. So uh, you know, we go to one of our go-to guys, and all night, you know, we came up with big catches with our receivers. Uh, Jordan Hayes was dynamite at quarterback, made some good decisions and some great throws under pressure. and. Uh, so I was proud of them. Not, not that uh, Jacob didn't have a great night, but yeah. it seemed like Jordan has threw more in this game than yeah. typical well, game plan. They're a big physical football team, you know, and, and they're good coaches, and uh, they're, you know, their game plan, we're going to take away a run, and so we had to throw it. And uh, you know, I thought we did a pretty good job of that. Your big receivers seem to come up pretty yeah, big, especially absolutely. Redding. Yeah, yeah. Sanders been doing it all year, you know. Uh, Sam Merrill did a great job. We had uh, little Ryan Curtis over here made the catch over here to, you know, to, to tie it up. So, yeah, that, that's as good a high school football game as you're going to see. You know, two good teams that just battled right to the very end, and uh, you know we're fortunate to win, get the win. Can you talk a little bit about the resiliency of your team tonight? I mean, they fought the whole night and they finally... Yeah, we knew that coming into it, you know. This wasn't going to be a shutout on either way. It was, you know, you can't get your head down. You know, we played from behind most of the game. Um, that two-point, you know, conversion here on the end was big for us, you know, to get us back to a tie. Uh, there at the end, you know, we had it with, what, 40-something seconds and fourth and one. You know, I felt pretty good. I thought we had the momentum coming in our way, and I thought, well, we'll just punt it. Because if you don't, you're on a short field. They got 40 seconds, and the field goal beats you. So it's kind of a decision.